Impact Wrestling presents Emergence. Streaming live Sunday, August 27th. The following contest is a hair versus hair match. Introducing first from Birmingham, England, Rockstar Spy. Our main event moments away, but as you just saw next week, Lashley seems ready. Kurt Angle seems ready. Those two go one-on-one -on -one for the first time ever for the TNA World Heavyweight Championship. That's seven days from right now. However, we settle in for our main event as Rockstar Spud has issued the challenge. Spud wants to go one-on-one -on -one with EC3. EC3 accepted it will be hair versus hair. And as you just saw, Spud handed off the briefcase. He's got a future X Division Championship match inside, but Spud has bigger things on his mind tonight. Those bigger things being a one-on-one -on -one match with his arch rival, his nemesis, Ethan Carter III. Rockstar Spud. EC3, our main event, is next. Ladies and gentlemen, EC3. Welcome back to Friday Night Impact on Destination America. This is our main event. Ethan Carter, the third. The one percenter, privileged, entitled, self-obsessed. Just a few of the words that you can use to describe EC3. Earlier tonight, he talked about 16 months not being pinned, not being submitted. Defeated guys like Sting, Kurt Angle, Bully Ray, still wearing the heavy arm brace. We've asked EC3 to tell us why he's wearing the brace. He told us it's none of our business. He does what he wants. And EC3 pretty much can do whatever he wants as the nephew of TNA President Dixie Carter. Spud laid down the challenge last week, said this has to end. All the humiliation, everything that EC3 has done, to Rockstar Spud over the number of months. Everything that EC3 did to Jeremy Borash by shaving his head. It all ends tonight. Hair versus hair. Spud versus EC3. Obviously Spud has the hometown advantage. The opening bell in our main event is underway. Rockstar Spud has talked about it being a dream come true to compete on the Impact roster. Another dream coming true tonight by competing inside Wembley Arena in London. Spud from about 200 miles away in Birmingham. And Spud going off on EC3. If Rockstar Spud has any chance in this match, what is it? I don't think he has any chance. Frankly, Spud is not in EC3's league. Maybe one day, but not yet. But I do respect Spud's intensity. If Rockstar Spud has a chance, it's in the early going. Get after EC3. And Spud doing that here. Spud is all over EC3, man. I didn't expect this. And the chair. The barber chair that you see, the loser of this match, and Spud's biting the face of EC3. Whatever it takes, right? And Rockstar Spud with a drop kick. And EC3 is floored. Great job by Spud thus far. This kid is on fire. Rockstar Spud, with all his determination, and all his heart, and all his desire, may have a chance here tonight against EC3. And just when you start to think that perhaps Spud's got something going, that he's building momentum. EC3 with that big boot. And now 
now EC3. When that happened, when that boot happened, you can almost see the size advantage, the speed advantage, the strength advantage that EC3 has over Rockstar Spud. Yes, Josh, I totally agree. And as we would have assumed, this is an uphill battle for Spud. EC3 has been held bent, borderline obsessed with shaving the head of Rockstar Spud. It's about humiliating Spud. It's about embarrassing. Rockstar Spud, EC3 missing, Spud connecting. Oh, what a clothesline, though. EC3 for Spud, and perhaps his chances. Can Spud get back in this thing? We find out when our main event continues. Welcome back to Friday Night Impact. This is our main event. It's hair versus hair. It's EC3 versus arch rival, Rockstar Spud. EC3 undefeated, never been pinned, never submitted. Rockstar Spud said, hey, I want to end your streak, and I want to shave your head bald. Can Rockstar Spud fuel himself off the energy in London, England? Can Rockstar Spud fuel himself off of these great fans? Does Rockstar Spud have a chance here tonight? Can the ultimate underdog defeat EC3? What a move by Spud! Take one more look at Rockstar Spud throwing caution to the wind to take out his rival. Spud doing everything he can to defeat EC3. Awesome front senton off the top corner. High risk with legit reward. It's high risk moves like that that may propel Spud to a victory here tonight. Do you believe in miracles? Yes, wait a second. Uh, the referee dealing with EC3, and there's the heavy, the bodyguard Tyrus with a power bomb to the outside. Yeah, that sucks that EC3 most probably had that set up for the interference. Wow. Tyrus has no business being out here. EC3 was watching it all unfold. He had the referee's attention. He had the referee's focus. Spud's out. EC3 had a plan. If it's looking bleak for me, Tyrus, you got to make things right. And right on cue, Tyrus delivering a devastating powerbomb. Right to the floor of Wembley Arena. Spud's done. And Spud kicks out at two. Wow, he kicked out with life. Holy crap. Talk about wherewithal. Well, Tyrus is still out here. EC3 is still direct, directing traffic. Oh, and look at this, EC3. It's Mr. Anderson. Mr. Anderson has come to the aid of Spud over the past number of weeks. Taking it right to Tyrus. Well. Anderson really leveled the playing field for sure. And a mic check by Ken Anderson to Tyrus on the outside, and EC3 is living using that big heavy brace. That brace is held together by metal and hard, hard, hard plastic. And now Spud. Oh, and Spud gets hit with the brace. I'm gonna tell you, man. Great chance one of those sharp hinges split open the head of Spud. And I'll tell you, it was some blow. He just used it as a weapon, and Spud's busted open. Rockstar Spud, as a result of getting hit with the heavy brace that EC3 wears, you can see the middle there has all that metal, and it busted open the forehead of Spud. You never know how a man is going to react to seeing his own blood when it starts pouring down your face. He either scares the hell out of you, or it fuels you. What's it gonna do to Rockstar Spud, who may not know where he is at this point? Spud may be out on his feet. Yeah, that seems to be a large open move for sure, man. EC3 not gonna stop now, though. That wound on Spud's forehead is just getting deeper. And EC3 using it as his offense here. Free Brian Hebner may, he may wanna stop this match. 
It is the referee's discretion to end this. I don't think Spud wants it to end, but... It... Oh! Man, Spud is in really bad shape. This might get really ugly. Spud wanted a one-on-one -on -one match with EC3. EC3 often talks about how he's defeated some of the greats. There you saw the stinger splash. It's like the calling card of EC3 collecting something from his past victims. The best friend of rock star Spud, the man responsible for bringing Spud to impact wrestling due to British boot camp is Jeremy Borash. JB's beside himself. JB told Spud earlier, you don't have to do this. You don't have to have this match. She's uh, gotten very uncomfortable. Borash better be careful, very careful, or he'll get bloodied also. And JB has popped up in the ring. JB with the low blow. Whoa! Great timing with JB. Rockstar Spud with a stunner. Rockstar Spud into the cover. Spud hooks the leg, and Spud nearly beats EC3. Was that the last ditch effort for Rockstar Spud? Does Spud have anything left in the tank? Can the biggest underdog in the history of Impact Wrestling end the streak of EC3? And EC3 may have just ended Rockstar Spud. Ah, oh, look at the blood just pouring out of the face, the head of Rockstar Spud. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm being told right now that we're going to be taking some steps to help with the graphic nature of what you're watching. Yeah, that's a good thing. This is nasty. Spud losing lots of blood and getting destroyed. EC3 didn't even go for a cover moments ago. EC3 could end this match. For EC3, that's, that's not what this is all about. Spud has taken a... Oh, wait a second. Look at this kid! EC3 screaming, stay down! Spud refusing. They got to admire and respect the heart and determination of Rockstar Spud. Spud, perhaps from all the love that he's getting here in London, perhaps from all the spirit of everyone in Wembley, Spud is not backing down and is taking down EC3. Holy on fire, Batman. Spud is rolling. Get rocking, brother. Forearm after forearm. Shining wizard. And Rockstar Spud. C3! Oh no, the dreaded five on two! Spud's got EC3 now! Ducks the clothesline, kick right to the back of the head! That is nuts! Spud is getting it done, as if he's channeling wrestlers of past! Rockstar Spud is fired up! Spud looking for the underdog! On EC3, Spud lands on his feet. Oh, what a big shot there. That arm brace coming into play again. Spud down, and Spud kicks out at two. 
That look of shock on EC3's face is a look most of our faces have right now. I can't believe this. The blood of Rockstar Spud is all over EC3. EC3 looks shocked that Spud was able to kick out moments ago. Is EC3 gonna finally do in and put away Rockstar Spud as Spud is clawing and climbing and scratching his way back to his feet? Looks like EC3 is about to end this right now. And EC3, that's got to be the death bill. The cover, spud down, and EC3. Ladies and gentlemen. Here is your winner, EC3. Well, an exhausted EC3 has finally done what he set out to do. EC3 wanted to embarrass Rockstar Spud, wanted to humiliate Rockstar Spud. Remember, Spud now, well, he's gonna get his head shaved after everything that Spud just went through, after the beating that he just took, after how bad this was, after the fact that we altered what you're looking at. Rockstar Spud is now gonna get his head shaved by EC3. This is what you wanted, EC3. Rockstar Spud, without a shadow of a doubt, you have the most heart and determination I've ever seen in a professional wrestler. Look, I've, I've, done, I've done some heinous things to you. I've attacked your friends. It was misguided, it was, it was severe. I was just trying to make a statement. But there was a time where we were best friends. And I ruined that. I ruined that. Spud, in front of your home people, your mom and your dad, you proved you belong in Impact Wrestling. Hell. You prove that despite your size, your heart weighs more, and there's a chance that one day you could be a world champion. You have the intangibles. You have it, man, and you're... I, I'm not gonna shave your head tonight. I'm not gonna embarrass you for any people. I, he doesn't deserve his head shaved. He proved he belongs. He proved he's one of you. He proved he's a fighter. He proved he's a lion, a tiger, a gazelle. And damn it, you proved you were a man. I, I don't expect you to take this, but I will offer my hand and shake your hand right here. I, I know we can never go back to the way it was. We'll go our separate ways. You shake my hand. Let's end this on good terms. Absolutely shocking. What a great show of sportsmanship from EC3. Yes, it's nice to see this respect from EC3. I'm very surprised, but you know what? I'm sure their long-time friendship has a lot to do with this. Well, it's the true spirit of competition. EC3 showing that here tonight in London, England. But kudos to EC3 for doing this, for allowing Rockstar Spud to walk up. Oh, what a low down, dirty SOB this EC3 is. Matt Spud, time to pay, time to pay. One more measure of humiliation from EC3 to Rockstar Spud. Where's your mom? Where's she sitting? Where's mama? Oh, where's your high school girlfriend? Where's your dad? Man, EC3 duped us all. 
Now, embarrassing spawn in front of his people and his family. The hollow words of EC3 from just moments ago, when you thought that this guy was finally going to do the right thing. This is disgusting. Take notice! Take notice! This ring, this company, this industry, and this world, it's mine now! A clear message from EC3. This world belongs to me. EC3 may finally be done with Rockstar Spud, and that means trouble for every single person on the Impact roster.